Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to my room. Today's actually my birthday, December 2nd, and I'm at home. Today's a Monday and a lot of people are at work. I mean, a lot of my friends have 95s, even though I'm about to join the 95 life. Anyway, I thought that, you know, something good and nice for me to do on my birthday is fix some nails. I just got some nails from Nailed to Go. These are press on nails. Let me open the box and show you how pretty they are. These are the nails, guys. These are so, so damn pretty. I love them so much. So I got sized from them and I picked out the nails that I wanted and they sent it to me. They also did a Christmas set. Oh my god, I love so much. I love this Christmas set so much. I decided that a great way to spend my birthday is to drink some whiskey. I got some Jameson here. And I'm gonna fix some press-on nails today and I'm gonna demo it for you guys. If you're actually interested in buying press-on nails, I have a discount code for you guys. Discount code gets you 15% off. I can't wait to show you how these nails are done. And this is actually my first time doing it, so I'm excited to try this out. Before we begin with today's video, please do me a huge favor and subscribe to my channel. I'd love for you to join the JLI Davy family here. Also, please don't forget to click on the notification bell so that I'll always get notifications of whenever you upload whenever I upload a new video. Are we ready for some nails? Are we ready for some nail action? Let's take a swig of whiskey and a swig of water. When I go out and party, I don't think my social media actually shows how much water I consume or how much water is always on the tables whenever I go out. I might like to enjoy myself and drink, but I always drink water. I always, I'm drinking water, I'm hydrating, trying my best not to get drunk because I hate, absolutely hate being drunk. But that's enough about me. Let's move on to these nails. What I love about these nails is that it comes with like an instruction manual and it also comes with like a kit. So the kit includes these buffer cubes cubes like this then you get alcohol swabs to swab and clean your nails you get nail glue and adhesive so you can choose which way you want to attach the nails to your fingers you also get this wonderful cuticle nail stick so that you can you know, prep your nails last but not least you have a little mini nail file and we need to prep our nails nail prep fold and lay an absorbent kitchen towel on a table I mean, I have a towel we can use, but I don't have a table. We have a towel in front of us. Take out the contents of the nail prep kit and lay them on the table. You might also need a tweezer or, and a hairpin to open the glue bottle. I don't think I want to use nail glue. I think I want to use the adhesives. Open one of the 70% alcohol ties and wipe all 10 natural nails very well. I want to see how easy it is to do this, especially when the nails are on, especially since I got really long nails, because I want a really nice stiletto nails, because... I like them. If I'm gonna do my nails, I want them to be like long and you know, I want them to be all out. So I'm just using the alcohol swab to clean my nails and to clean it and to disinfect. Also maybe to clean any residual food because I eat, I literally just had some KFC. This is why I hate my birthday being on a Monday because literally all the nice restaurants are closed. Like all the nice places I would have wanted to get food from are closed. Left with KFC. Just like, I'm just gonna take some KFC, I don't like KFC. I like KFC, funny enough. I like junk food. All right, take the nails out and size them on your nails to ensure you have a perfect fit. Any looks wide, you can use the nail file provided to file any of the nails to shape if necessary. Oh, wonderful, they just took light. Pretty sure you guys can hear the sound of the gen, but I hope the mic does a good job at hiding it. So now we have to decide which nails are we doing. Are we doing this black set right here? Are we doing the rose quartz? Are we doing the black mat? I think because it's my birthday, I deserve to do the gothic. So they say we should check if each one fits the nail. So this is the first one. Using the flat edge of the stick, push back your cuticle. So, okay. This isn't as hard as I thought it would be. I was honestly worried it would be so hard. Take the block buffer and use it to lightly buff your nails. This will help the press on nails stick on better. You know, smooth surface is always necessary. So I'm gonna do this all at the same time. So I'm gonna push my cuticles back. I'm gonna buff it. So I decided to file my nails just to make them round and easier. I think it'll be easier if the nails are like properly rounded and shaped. The nails on my left hand are much longer than the nails on my right hand. Blame it on the fact that I do a lot of stuff on my right hand. So I'm just gonna file them a little bit down, just a tiny bit, not too much. I mean, the press on nail is definitely longer than my real nail. So there's not gonna be a problem of that. I just want them to be a tiny bit shorter. I don't know if I've ever discussed like the weird, the stuff I like to watch on YouTube, but I just found a channel called 
Lady Knight the Brave. She does video essays about pop culture, so about movies, about TV shows, and they're like almost an hour long, but they're so good. Like I've watched like about three of them today. That's what I'm doing on today on my birthday. I'm fixing my nails and watching video essays on TV shows and movies. Use a second 70% alcohol tab to wipe all your fingernails very well, ensuring that there is no dust. So we're gonna clean everything up. Again, the sound of the gen might be annoying, I'm so sorry. But this is what it means to be a content creator in Lagos, Nigeria when they take lights. You guys have no idea how many times they've actually taken lights while I'm filming a video. And I'm just praying and sometimes they bring it back and sometimes they don't and that's why the video ends. I have so many half videos because they take lights. This one I'm determined to push through because Mm. It's finally time for us to actually put the nails on. Using your tweezers, peel off the adhesive tabs on the back and stick them to the back of the press-on nails, smoothing down with the tweezers to ensure that they stick on the nails. I put the adhesive on the back of the nail. I'm just smoothing it out. So let's stick it down on my nail for five seconds. Hey, I got some fresh nails. Okay, so we can do this. It's not hard. Picking the next set. Oops. <laughs> Where do you go? I don't have. Okay, I found you. I found it. Okay. Ah, why is it always falling? Why is it falling? Okay. There we go. There we go. Yay! Finally, we got to press it down for five seconds. There we go. I'm gonna drink a little bit more whiskey. Let me tell you the story of how I got this bottle of Jameson. So I went to a friend's wedding in Ikeja during the weekend. If you've been to a party in Lagos, especially as a young 20 something, there's always that table with alcohol in the back where all the guys are sitting and all the red cups and stuff like that. So I was sitting in the back near the back table where the alcohol was and I was like, hey, they have some alcohol, let me go get something to drink. So I took my red cup because they passed around red cups and I went there and I said, hey, can I have some Jameson? And they're like, sure. I opened it, I poured myself about two shots and I asked for Coke and I mixed it together. And then I was about to leave, they were like, you can have the bottle. I was like, what? They're like, yeah, you can keep the bottle. I was like, thank you, thank you very much. So that's how I got a bottle of Jameson at a wedding. <laughs> Let us do the third finger. I'm really worried about what's gonna happen by the time we get to this hand because I can't do shit with this hand, especially now that I'm gonna have nails on it. Woo! This is gonna be trippy and hilarious as well. Carefully peel it off there, put it on the nail. Look at my nails, yo. Oh my God, I got those Instagram nails. <laughs> Ooh, these are so pretty. I didn't even know they were transparent. These ones are kind of transparent. They have kind of like a net detail in them. So pretty. now so you can't hear the sound of the generators this is what my nails look like what do you guys think I like them so a couple of I think this one came off and that one came off funny enough is the same nail on each hand that came off but I just used another adhesive and I placed it and now we have these beautiful nails what do you guys think I really like them they're so long like I'm just like I feel like a Disney villain or I feel like a villain in general just like with these long ass nails I love the sound it makes Oh, is this ASMR? Is this ASMR? Is this working? Is it working? I hope you guys enjoyed me putting them on and just drinking on camera for you guys. My birthday is a very interesting time of the year for me. Usually I'm very, very happy to celebrate my birthday, but this year I'm just... Uh, this year has opened me up to a lot of sadness and heartache, and it has reminded me that I should always trust my gut. Always trust my gut. If I had trusted my gut, a lot of situations that I entered this year would have not happened. A lot of tears that I cried would have not happened. And I'm happy that this year is over. I feel like everything is done. I feel so done with the past. And it's like, I'm at a stage where I just wanna drop all my baggage. Even though this year has given me more baggage to carry into the next year, I'm very determined to 
not carry all that baggage just carry the experience and carry the lessons but not carry the baggage because lessons come with baggage and you can choose to drag it around with you or you can choose to just drop it and actually take what you need from the situation so i'm determined to do that on this day december 2nd 2019 i'm determined to let go of my baggage trust my gut and embrace the newness of my life. I'm starting a new job as the music and digital content editor for a music company and it is crazy because I never thought I would have that job. This is the first time I applied for a job that I thought I wouldn't get and I got it and I was like I'm actually excited to get this job. I'm really excited about the job. I'm excited about everything in general. I want to say huge huge thank you to you guys for watching and supporting and just being there. I love 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 you guys. If you're interested in some really nice and sexy press on nails like these one please check the link in the description box below and use my discount code to order you get 15% off if you have a particular design or a particular style or just something in particular that you want she can make it for you the Christmas sets this Christmas set right here was actually made custom for me so if you're interested in getting like a custom set for Christmas if you're interested in getting a gift for someone that might really like nails I think getting some nails is a good choice. So I really think this is a great way to wear some nice fancy nails without really like destroying your nails or breaking the bank. I think these nails are a good option to like, you know, jazz up your outfit and jazz up the way you look. All right guys, I, um, I've rambled, I've rambled. Thank you guys so much. Please do not forget to click the link in my description below and check these nails out. I'm really and truly grateful to you guys. I love you all. Peace and love.